what's going on guys welcome back to another diablo moral video we have some pretty big news today some of which is coming out of the china server some of which is coming out of the diablo immortal twitter we're diving into all of it today and seeing what all of this actually means and let's start out really quickly with what was said over on diablo immortal's twitter which is regarding the new class that's coming we already said that it's been the tempest it's someone that manages and manipulates water and air and as you can see right here from the image it says a storm is coming which is very much sounding like a tempest style class that we can expect coming to the game is that what you guys think is actually coming and i think that we are almost confirmed here with the things that we found in the code of the game with all the skills that are very tempest like and actually says the word tempest on it plus the teases that have been coming out it's all looking pretty good. But that is the smaller part of what we're here to talk about today because over in China, we had something very interesting released inside of the game. And I'm gonna go through this in full. And as we know, things that come to China oftentimes will come to us shortly after. And this was a post that was put on Reddit yesterday. And it reads, Diablo Immortal season, season server just launched in China this morning. It resets every month and is not pay to win. So we're talking about a seasonal server that's going to probably reset every season that has no pay to win elements. Terror gear seems to drop in the open world and there are big chests to open everywhere. You can reroll the attributes of your gear and there was a live stream where you could watch them play that and engage in that. But we actually have the patch notes of all of this right here in English so we could read through what it is in a very quick summary for you guys. It seems that it's going to be a monthly season that has a specific server that can be chosen when you log into the game. So it seems that you could play your normal character on your server that you're on now, and I guess start a seasonal character on this other special seasonal server. And in there, there's no pay to win elements, everything. It actually seems like a modded server where everything is crazy. You could have as much attack as you want, as much explosion as you want. You could have any enemies that you want. So let's go through this. I'm going to go through this one in full here today because there are a lot of details. And if this actually does come to us here in North America, it could be very exciting for the game. Let's be honest. Diablo Immortal came out and everyone was saying pay to win game. And that's, that's all they're here for is a money grab. So if they come out with a game mode or a server that is zero pay to win, I thought this would never happen. Let's see if it's actually going to. Say... Uh, Keep in mind, this is all from Chinese, translated to English. It could get wonky at times. Let's dive in. Say goodbye to worries. The new season server reaches the pinnacle of cool gaming. As an orthodox mobile game in the Diablo series, Diablo Moral has always insisted on continuously enriching legendary equipment, adding more challenging maps, and developing more innovative gameplay, just to provide players with a smoother experience. I can say... This is true. The updates that come to the game are always, for the most part, improving the game and always 100% adding to the game. A great gaming experience. Today, Diablo Immortal will innovate again and launch a new season server gameplay. I was told that Diablo Immortal, when they launched Diablo Immortal, it was said that there will not be seasons in the game. Could that be changing? In the season server, players will experience passionate battles with full firepower, ultra high explosion rates of legendary equipment on the screen, and rapid growth. Multiple surprise privileges will help players get rid of their worries and achieve unprecedented gains, a high burning gaming experience. So I don't know what this banner says. I think it looks pretty darn cool if you ask me, but man, they're saying right here, it's like a limitless server, which is quite exciting. The gameplay is innovative and refreshing, and every season has a new experience, which means this is not just a one-time thing. A new or new season gameplay, constantly refreshing experience. Whether it's the ever-increasing BD section for the constantly updated gameplay and demons, the gameplay creativity and sanctuary will never run out. This afternoon, the season server of Diablo Mortal opens. Players can start a passionate adventure by selecting season server in the game server list. Right now, all of us log on and see if that's available. If we can see season server in our game, let's not lie. We know you did that. 
In the newly launched season system, each season has a unique theme for this season, which will bring players a steady stream of freshness, allowing every player to gain a unique gaming experience. This season will launch the theme of Demon God Advent for the first time, and the battle rhythm will be faster just to allow players to challenge the limits and experience the fun of battle. This legit, if if this goes global, this legit could explode Diablo Immortal to being one of the best action RPGs on mobile. Actually, it already is the best action RPG on mobile, so it could even go beyond that. This this is like a D3 approach to Diablo Immortal. Uh, man, being that we do have a PC client, and it actually works quite well. I could even see some players coming back to Diablo Immortal that have stopped, you know, those PC gamers that didn't want to play the mobile experience or the pay to win experience. This could bring them back. Let's see. Five special blessings of the Diablo Shang Yu ceiling season server. Five cool points, a stunning start. Character upgrading is slow and you want to reach the top in one step. The explosion rate is not enough. Want to fill your screen with orange light come to the season server these wishes can come true essentially what they're saying is the normal grind and the normal gameplay is not fast enough and is not intense enough for you as a player so it will be here we'll officially launch today players can go to season server create a character and enjoy the five core cool points skills have no cooldown so you can literally spam skills infinitely and the full screen skills are full of monsters so tons of bosses, monsters, and such. With full firepower, you can mow the grass wildly, allowing you to have a great time swiping monsters. Infinite synthesis, abnormal growth, and numerical values can reach the sky in one step. You can feel the fun of dominating the game. With the blessing of 100 times explosion rate, you can enjoy endless swiping, enjoying the ultimate luck with a full screen of orange light. Full screen monsters, swipe everything in a flash, and enjoy an invincible experience. All players in the server start from the same point. Swipe treasures and fight monsters fairly and justly. Say goodbye to Krypton, and you can be on the list without spending a penny. Wow, they even are going in there and saying that you could be crushing and doing everything that the game has to offer without spending a penny. They, they literally went there and said that you don't have to spend here. Five cool points support the season server and you have endless fun pioneering. Go to the season server and gain the unprecedented, exciting gaming experience. And we even have a little bit of a Blood Knight image right there. I mean, this sounds this sounds like next level Diablo Immortal. It sounds like it sounds like a Diablo Immortal launching without any pay to win and potentially the way that the game should have launched in the first place. Uh, actually, I like all the depth the game has. I could see this just being intense all the time and not having all of the game modes i'm sure it won't but maybe we'll get a little bit more information here play the season server to witness your strength fairly and impartially fair competition full server competition in the season server at the beginning of each season all players results from the previous season will reset to zero at that time all players will stand in the same starting line again and the brave will face off again without fear okay so we're talking about facing off are there leaderboards or is there pvp in the theme of the advent of demon god players have 10 to 15 minutes to brush the map after arriving at each scene trying to brush up more red equipment improve their combat power and defeat the boss in the next time to verify their strength thus entering a new level more powerful equipment will appear in the new boss in the new levels and more affixes will be opened so more essences players need to consistently adjust their bd with more powerful combinations defeat the boss and challenge the limit it's worth mentioning that each scene map has high resource areas and low resource areas. The more resources, the stronger the monsters. So obviously, I would say more towards the center of the map where there's more condensed with monsters, you're going to have more resources and on the outskirts, you'll have less. Players will lose their existing equipment after death. Return to the save point on the current map and use the initial equipment again. Challenge. Only with good planning and skill for operations can strong ones reach the end reach the top of the season server rankings and stand in the top of the honor. All right, so it says it right there. Season server rankings. So there will be a leaderboard for this server to see how you place, how long you survive, I guess how much you accumulate. 
there we go a nice looking barbarian surprise hits the list and special benefits shine across the server two major server themes surprises to get for free even if you pass the demon god the surprises and challenges are far from over in addition to the first season theme the demon god is coming that will be launched today which was yesterday the season server will also usher in endless reincarnation season theme on may 6th that is literally five days from today players you will be you will also enter new environments try new gameplay and game more exquisite rewards exquisite limited benefits free gifts for defeating the devil in demon arrival players can obtain limited title rewards after clearing any demon boss players will also receive rare appearance transmog transmog rewards after clear clearing higher difficulty bosses appearances and titles will not disappear with the reset of the season oh that's cool all titles and transmog appearances obtained by players will permanently exist on the season season server account allowing to become a shining star every season and to exist not only that diablo mortal will also calculate rewards based on the player's performance in each season the stronger the player the more rewarding it'll be the top three players in rankings will receive NetEase carefully selected card that can be worth up to 800 wands so they're literally giving you cash for doing this or chinese cash so i'm assuming also that the rewards that you gain here are held within this server and they won't be shared with your main account on your on the main servers so far looking pretty darn good smash planning second anchor versus planning speed challenge planning will be beaten again question mark the anchor hands are dedicated to treating tough talk tonight at this time beating planning activity starts again in the last event planned by bad beat the scene of the planner sliding in, this is confusing sliding and kneeling at the speed of the light and calling dad on the spot still fresh in people's memory all right this was obviously something that went down in an event that happened over in china and it looks like there's going to be some type let's let's see here how will they regain face this time the new season server planner versus anchor event is about to kick off diablo immortal has specifically invited four well-known immortal anchors solar we have yc lao bao and chang lan to compete with diablo immortal numerical planning and battle planning start a wonderful showdown in the in the new season server it's better to be a planner who plays games all day long and specializes in dealing with all kinds of dis dissatisfied people or is it better to have a better game plan by the anchors who have deep understanding of the game and specialize in dealing all kinds of tough talk. So essentially, there's going to be a uh, face-off between these two teams in that server, or apparently it had already happened. The season starts today. Come to Sanctuary and have fun fighting. Honestly, guys, this seems pretty darn epic. Uh, seasons in Diablo Immortal, it seems like they're actually here, at least in China, or it, it doesn't seem like it they are seasons in diablo immortal are here in china the main question is will we get them here in north america let me know what you think about this whole seasons thing do you think it's going to be too much do you think you're going to be like if i do the season server i'm not going to have enough time to manage my main server where i have my main account that could be a potential issue if you have limited time to play but it definitely is another option and potentially new players coming to the game can play on the season server and not even start a main account on another server as well. They would miss the lore. They would miss a lot of the gameplay elements that are there, but they would be able to experience what's going on on the seasonal server. This is extremely exciting. Hoping that we can get it over here in North America. Please subscribe if you enjoyed this video and you want to stay up to date with everything Diablo Immortal.